Hey y'all, June 2nd. Uh, busy day out here today. Uh, we got the place cleaned up real nice. Vacuumed, cleaned. I mean, it ain't been this clean in a while. Uh, took the bumper off John's car. Uh, after we got the radiator off, the uprights off, the winglets off, everything off, pipe off, all that stuff. Had it uh, up here and Rich did all the welding on it. Uh, shot a couple videos for the welding company. So if you see those on the site, they, they'll probably only be up long enough so I can send them to the, the welding company because there's something wrong with our welder. It works, it don't work, it works, it don't work. Um, of course, all the video we tried to take today, we were trying to force it to have the, 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 the false overheating fault. And it finally did. And then when we only got one helmet, Rich didn't bring his helmet home from work. So he took the helmet off and gave it to me. I stuck the camera inside it and then he turned his head away and was just trying to get it out. And of course the arc worked. So damned if you do, damned if you don't, right? Um, so we're done with this for the next couple of days. Uh, today being Friday, tomorrow, Saturday, we'll bring the trailer over from Rich's house. Um, we'll finish working on the Amadog. Had the clutch off, changed the gear. Uh, took the uh, the base of the adjusters off, right off, all six of them. Uh, cleaned them all up. Put the fiber washers that John Ritchie sent us. We appreciate that, John. It was a uh, tin roof gig. Appreciate that. And we put the uh, I think they're Viton O-rings. They're orange O-rings. They feel and look a little thicker than the brand new black ones he sent me that I just put in, and they were leaking. This this shoulder. Uh, uh, spacer, whatever you call it, on, on two of the, the six, when you wiggle, you could kind of force it, wiggle it, and you could see oil juice coming up out of there. So the O-rings weren't weren't sealing up, and we had a little, that gingerman, we had a little, little, didn't get on our suit, thank goodness it didn't get on our suit, right Glenda? That would have been terrible to try to clean. Um, but, we might have, we might have had to order a new one. <laughs> anyway. Back to the go-kart. We got it all back together. Um, didn't put the can on yet, but uh, we're running the sportsman can. And um, yeah, we're just we just gotta fill it up with oil tomorrow. Put the proper amount of oil in it. Uh, RTV high high temp RTV the uh, plug. Put that back in. Maybe we'll start it. Maybe we won't. You know, and and do a clutch run. I mean, we can do that out there at the track. No big deal. We got all day, right? Plenty of help out there. So. Uh, thanks to Steve Pastiner. Thanks, Steve O, that gave me the uh, uh, gearing. I mean, we had 1473 on it with the big tires, and it felt like it was a, with a pipe, and it felt like it was okay. But um, I really enjoy this can. If you've never, if you've been a Yamaha guy and ran, always ran a pipe and never ran the Sportsman can, you need to try it. It is surprisingly fast, and and. Actually, a gingerman. I the first three laps of that race, I had tears. I was laughing so hard. Now that might be a little different. A guy coming from doing nothing but shifting gears for 20 years, and getting into a gas and brakes go kart. That alone was pretty hilarious. But um, it was good fun, and then they run pretty damn good, just with a, a, a non-tuned exhaust on it. You know, so um, yeah, give it a try. So tomorrow we'll finish it up and we'll get it in the trailer Sunday after church. Uh, we're done about noonish or so. Pack a cooler into some clothes, or whatever, into the truck, and, and we're out of here probably one, two o'clock in the afternoon on Sunday. And we'll be back probably Tuesday afternoon. We're probably going to stay Monday night after we're done. So get us a nice shower, little bonfire with a couple of the guys that are going to stay. Uh, at least Todd. And uh, hey, Todd, what's up? Good, 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 uh, good luck. Be careful coming over. Looking forward to seeing you again. And, uh, and we're just gonna go do our thing, man, you know, and, and try to let the world lose its mind as we go to our little sanctuary called Granton Raceway. So um, that's it for the RPM update. Things are going well with the, with the 250 project, with this here, everything's, it's all kosher, it's all good. So we're gonna, we're gonna say, uh, God bless you all, Godspeed, hang in there, it will get better. I'll get some helmet cam, God willing, <laughs> in the old Yama dog at Granton. Talk to y'all later.